Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is Nicholas Snow H and I'm here with another TXT reaction. So yeah, um, I was actually going to do the guide this week. However, uh, I kind of want to listen to a few more songs before I get into that. Um, just because it's a very long video. Um, didn't have that much time today to record. So uh, this one is one I've actually wanted to get to the past few weeks. I'm really excited. So yeah, this one's going to be uh, zero times zero x one, zero times one equals love song. I know I love you uh, featuring Sayori. I uh, don't know if that's a singer or a rapper, artist, um, but we're going to see. Um, if you've never been to my channel before, I have a lot of previous uh, TXT reactions on my playlist. Um, also a community tab that I update every week. And also a Patreon for any blocked reactions. I uh, may start doing some variety content there in the future for very cheap. Um, other than that, uh, yeah, I'm really excited. I really like the, the sound of this group. Um, and they're obviously blowing up. And I'm really proud that they're getting a lot of fans and a lot of eyes on them uh, including me just figuring them out and uh, just learning about them rather um and uh yeah i do need you guys to start viewing the, the videos though um they're for some reason they're by far the least viewed uh, uh reaction or content that i do um and maybe it's just because uh just how popular they are and there's a lot of uh, reactors out there um i also see it with bts sometimes that when there's just so much content to go through uh, a lot of these channels get very uh, few views or uh, the algorithm kind of messes with it and uh, you're not really shown for that long or maybe i'm just not standing out enough however uh, i try to just give my honest uh, reactions to it uh, i don't try to you know fake or overhype it but um i'm genuinely genuinely impressed every time i listen to them uh so a uh, really fun journey so far and uh yeah can't wait to hear this I'm gonna get right to it um i think they mentioned that this was one of their more kind of rock songs again uh, could be wrong uh i was wrong last time with frost i think but uh yeah let's get right to it three two one go you can say that adolescence is a whole universally present in the lives of everyone large or small we experience hunger and emptiness in our soul during this period however to some boys this whole invades their lives with excessive frequency and in complex forms interesting you don't see quotes very much before k-pop videos anymore or videos in general. Oh. I like this kind of carefree, like, brotherhood type of thing. I look like the hills, the mountains in the back. Build up. Whoa. Wait, 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 wait. I love how that, I just love how that built. Um, it was like a quiet intensity, like towards the end of it, it really picked up. Um, but you know, dur during when you're watching it, it's just kind of like going very fast. Um, the, you're, you're kind of uh, captivated just by you know the, these scenes. Uh, it feels kind of like a TV show, actually. Uh, very, you're not really thinking, or at least I, I don't feel like I'm watching a music video um, so far. But uh, yeah, I just love those those drums creeping in, um, and then kind of like the, that screaming, uh, or not screaming, but uh, intense uh, kind of like strained vocals going to the chorus. Uh, sounds really really nice and I like that so here it starts building a lot and this Is that Sayori? I was say one of them had a very uh, like high pitched voice. These lyrics though. 
For some reason that reminded me of Ariana Grande. But I think this came out before that. That that rhythm. Oh. I thought it'd go more intense. I love I love how it slowed down. <laughs> oh. Say you love me, say you love me, say can you get the truth? All in the thin, I want all the This is like a like a TV show. Say you love me, say you love me, say can you get the truth? Oh, looks like they have really a good time together. Obviously, they're acting, but it looks natural enough that they they care a lot about each other. Drums are really um, prominent. So it's a very uh, good atmosphere for the song. Cool. I think this is my favorite song from them so far. That was, whoa, not over yet. Was he dreaming? Oh, interesting. Yeah, um, that was my favorite one so far. Um, definitely, it had the rock feel. It wasn't like a, you know, there wasn't any crazy guitars or anything like that. There's a very steady rhythm uh, in the back of it. Uh, like I said, those drums were the main thing that uh, kind of, um, very, very hard to explain kind of song. It was very feel good, uh, kind of like nostalgic type of feel. Um, kind of, uh, you know, it really gave you the sense of like a brotherhood um, and enjoying your adolescence and being kind of carefree um, but does anybody else feel like a very small like sadness within the song as well uh, I, I really don't know how to explain it uh, but I kind of feel that within the song even if it, it isn't sad at all I, I need to look at the lyrics and stuff like that um, or read them uh, in, more in depth afterwards but uh, I, I, have, I have a feeling of sadness as well uh, that was awesome uh, they are really impressing me they seem to be very closely uh, close-knit group uh, tight bond and um, I think they obviously are going to be in the future uh, forced to be reckoned with um, you know especially with uh, BTS going on hi hiatus recently uh, and they're gonna start doing solo stuff that they so all these boy groups have a chance to kind of um, you know be that number one spot uh, as, as a group and uh, I'm sure they're all gonna put their best foot forward and uh, just trying to make good music and uh, yeah uh, I really like them and uh, thank you guys for watching my channel uh, hopefully this gets more views. We'll see. Uh, but if not, the ones that do check it out, I really appreciate it. And I'll see you next time.